to the Green Apple Home. So today I am just making some treats. My sister um, has kids that are wheat, gluten, dairy, allergic. So I <laughs> made, I made some regular snickerdoodles and her kids can't eat them, but she can and she never really makes herself her own batch of cookies. So I, I decided this is what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna drop some cookies off to her, but I thought I'd make it fun. So we're making it into like a little witch's um, broom. And so it is so simple. I've seen kits of these in stores like AC Moore that go for $25. And all, all it is is they're using the same materials basically, except the sticks are fake. So make your own and save a bundle because there's no, there's really no need unless you just have money to burn, in which case you need to just send it my way. <laughs> there's no way you should be spending $25 on a kit for this kind of stuff. Anyways, all right. So what it is is it's this little broom. It's just a lunch sack tied up with a stick. I did a ribbon. You can do raffia. You can just leave it plain. Um, what do you do is you take a lunch bag and then you cut it into strips, however, you know, thick or thin you want. Okay, so the cookies are in there, see? And all you want to do is gather the little broomage, <laughs> the little strands, and then put your stick down and then gather it. Then you can either use a rubber band or a twisty tie, anything simple, easy. Um, and then it'll end up like this. So far I did three brooms. Um, I decorated each different and I actually did a second variation on the broom. So I'll show you. Uh, the first one you already saw I decorated with ribbon with a stick. The second one I just decorated with stickers. It says Happy Halloween. These ones I took down farther and these ones I left up a little bit. So you could do either way depending on the look that you want. For the broom this one I think may look more like a broom I'm not sure I don't know anyways um, with this one I just did a regular lunch sack and then um, took a second lunch sack cut the bottom off and then um, took the scissors and did strips up until the very tippy top and then just put it over the regular bag I just kind of put it over the regular bag and then gathered it together with a twisty tie and then I have some curling ribbon and I have a little tag that says trick or sweep <laughs> this is the witch so anyways um those are three little styles you can use so cute and fun wouldn't you like to get some cookies on your porch with this um close to Halloween yes the answer is yes <laughs> all right thanks for watching we'll see you next time on the green apple home which one do you like best